What's up everybody? Matt from Butcher Shop Taxidermy. We're back again here at Chuck's house to uh we're just gonna give you a little preview today of what's soon to come. We've been uh putting it off long enough. Mm -hmm. It's uh luckily it's one that doesn't really have a time frame to get done in, so yeah, check this out. I tried to put I wanna put these in Matt's antelope today. Something we, tells me that wouldn't work too well. We said his customer might notice. Yeah, you, you never know. <laughs> but uh, if we got the largest size mouth condom we could get. Yep. It's a little small, but we'll make it work. Yep, it needs about another three inches of mouth in there. We'll but... plant it as far in the back as we can and go out from there, but it's a place to start. Yep, yep. It's going to save us a lot of carving and whatnot. Yeah. So, And yeah. where'd that come from, from the people that asked, Mackenzie? Yeah. Sadly. Yeah, well, sometimes you got to do it. Sometimes you got to, because that's, we couldn't find one anywhere else. Yep. Uh, I was saying about calling down to B&B &B in Texas, because, uh, you know, Joe and Travis made that 16-foot crock that would fit this. So I'm wondering if they, uh, maybe they molded the mouth on that one. Yeah, you never know. For private reserve. Yeah. We'll see. Yep, so this is going to be interesting. We're going to get this thing soaking up here in the next next couple trips and uh, see what we can do. we got to get that mouth opened up. This thing's been tanned for a few years, so it's going to be kind of tricky to get it done without completely demolishing it. But if anybody can do it, it's us. So, yeah. And then tell them what else we're going to do. Make skin mold. Yep, we're going to see. You can see there's some epidermal slip here. We're going to take and mold some of the parts parts where there's still skin left and we'll take and once we epoxy that in we'll take and press that mold of the the skin onto the epoxy to give it the actual scale look and everything so it should be all good to go we'll see what actually happens like i said anybody that can do it it's going to be us because we don't know what the hell we're doing That's so right those Yep, sometimes the best way to get something done is to not know how the hell to do it. That works for us. Yep. All right. There you go. It's a man eater. For real. It's a song, isn't it? Yeah. 